all Android smartphones and tablets prevent the device from staying on all the time thanks to the screen timeout feature. This is generally tucked away in the display section of the settings app, but I have seen some OEMs move it to the lock screen instead. The idea is to prevent you from accidentally leaving the device on for an extended period of time. This helps most people to save battery life of the device since it's generally a good idea to lock the smartphone or tablet when it is not in use. Some OEMs even include an option that will disable this feature by using the camera to detect if your eyes are looking at the screen or not. Most OEMs only let you set this to a max of 15 or 30 minutes, but that just isn't good enough for some people. I have previously uploaded a video showing how to set the screen timeout option to any time you like just by using a simple ADB command. But today I want to highlight a free application that allows you to disable the feature entirely. The application even has an option that lets you customize the screen timeout feature to whatever you want as long as the service is enabled. This application is called Caffeine, and you can download it for free in the Google Play Store. I'll be including a link to this application in the video description below for those who want a fast way to find it. Once the application has been installed, it's not actually going to be enabled yet. To turn on this service, we need to edit our quick settings panel and then find the caffeine panel at the bottom of our inactive tiles list. So you're going to see that tile down here at the bottom and you're just going to tap and hold so that you can drag it into your active quick settings panel. Once you have it in our quick settings panel, we can turn the feature on and off thanks to this simple tile. So even though we have our screen timeout feature set to 15 seconds now, once we enable the caffeine service, it will bypass the operating system's option for the screen timeout and it will allow you to keep the screen on for longer than what it is set right here. So you can see even though we have it set to 15 seconds right now, it's not going to go into its automatic lock state since we have enabled that caffeine service. Now there are some useful features tucked away in the options page of this application, which we can access by tapping on the application icon for caffeine. So for example, we can have the application always display a notification that shows the status of the service. And this can be useful if you don't want to keep checking the quick settings tile to find out if you have caffeine enabled or not. We can enable a screen dimming toggle so that even though the smartphone or tablet is not allowed to be locked, it can lower the brightness to save us some much needed battery life. There's even an option to prevent the application from being shown in the recents page so that we don't accidentally swipe it away and kill the background service. And speaking of the background service, 
if you notice that Android is killing the caffeine service in the background, which Android likes to do, then look under the advanced section to find the ignore battery optimization feature that we can tap it, change this over to all apps, find the caffeine service, and then disable battery optimization for this app. There's also an option that allows us to set a custom screen timeout for our device as long as the caffeine service is active. We can change this to 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour, or set it to a variable. So as long as the service is active via the quick settings tile, then it will bypass the screen timeout feature set by the Android operating system itself and only follow what we have it set up in this application. There are a number of ways that we can disable and set a custom limit to our screen timeout feature on Android. This will be the third video that I've done on the subject and each one can be useful depending on the situation. I'll be including links to the other two videos that I've done down in the description below.